Listen, you a coward. You a I coward. Bet. I bet. You a freaking coward, dude. I bet. You scared of my questions and you don't want to be challenged. It's God. It's God. It's God. How can Jesus be God if he has a God? Yeah, very simple. Let's start there. Uh, uh, that's uh okay, no problem. So uh, as Trinitarians, we believe that Jesus mm -hmm. uh, is united in the same divine essence as the Father and, and the mm -hmm. Spirit. Okay. And so when Jesus decides to humble himself and come down and take on the form of a human and the form of a servant, when he takes on flesh that and humbles himself, takes on the position of the servant that is when the father becomes his god so it's not that it's a that the father is a separate being deity than he is it's a position <clears throat> of servitude that is being described here he submits his will and humbles himself to the father and that's why uh, in the flesh uh, the father is jesus is god now, with that being stated, let's let's lay some ground. Let's lay some like foundations. Of remember, I remember, I was remember, I was saying that let's try not to draw our answers too long, yeah, and let's no, try to make I them just, short I, as possible. Just, yeah, I just I just yes. answered your question. Mm -hmm. I want to I want to throw something out there though, because I don't want to just be. It's not an interrogation, right? It's a conversation, right? So, I want us to establish something. Let's let's talk about what God is. So we both believe that God has always existed, right? He is infinite, the first and the last, right? We agree there? I agree that Allah has always been here. Yes, go ahead. Okay. So if if it, if the Bible says that Jesus has always been there, that means that Jesus is God as well, correct? No. But we you just said that only God has always existed. Only the only the creator. Yes. Right. Only so, the creator. Right. So if Jesus has always existed, that means he's the creator, right? No, it does not mean that. <laughs> so then that would mean that something else can other than the creator can uh, always exist. Well, according to your Bible, you call him the father and you you answered my question earlier that Jesus was not the father. So who comes first, the father or the son? No, there's no coming first. I'm asking, I'm asking you a question. I'm, I'm asking you. There is no coming. Okay, but you just answer. you just said. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Listen to me. You, we. And you're I'm not answering the uh, question. Uh, okay. No, listen, listen, listen. Listen, listen. You can say that all you want to to try to run your little game. It's not working here. Okay. So what I'm saying is, um, what I said to you, you you said earlier to me uh, that Jesus was not the Father, right? So my question is to you is you're not answering who the, comes I first? Answered your question already. I listen, 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 listen. You didn't answer anything because we started fresh. What I'm asking you is this: Who comes first, the father or I the literally son? Just answered this. I'm asking well, who okay, is it? No, is no, does I'll, the, I'll does it father again. come first or does the I'll, son come I'll first? Answer it again. Hopefully, hopefully okay, you're go honest ahead. enough to where you don't have to ask this again. There is no who comes first. Both the Father and Jesus, according to the Bible, have always existed. Period. Always. Why does the Father? Why wait, does wait, the wait, Father wait, say? Wait, it's my turn. Why wait, does wait, the wait, Father? Wait. Listen, listen. This is so my life, and I do it the way I want to do it. And I'm being very fair. No, you're listen, not. Stop you're trying not to, to listen. Stop trying to listen. Stop trying to listen. You just what you want to do is you want to come here and have a debate with me. And then you want to do all this talking and do all the rambling you want to I do wanna, and not I, have me I, I talk very much so you could try to win the argument. No, I want to but we're not doing that, okay? Okay, but a conversation is going to be, I'm going to speak. If you're not going to talk, you can move around. I, I'm, I'm, it's another person here. My name is Dawood. All right, I'm not going to have you just doing a whole bunch of talking and rambling. And then as soon talking. as I get to speak, you want to shut me up. You want to. Listen, listen, I don't have time to play games with you, man. If yes, you come with brains and wits, let's be come with, listen, come with brains and wits, come with brains and wits. So, okay, so right? don't be afraid. To it's all about brain power. Back. So can I listen? I don't. Back? You've already asked the question. Yeah, you haven't answered. My question to you was, is the father. I asked you the question that the father come before the son. 
And what you was claim that Jesus can't. And according to you, neither one came first. Okay, so they always existed. Now, my question to you was, does anything other than the creator, other than God, have eternal existence? Does anything other than the creator have eternal existence? Nothing, nothing surpasses a law. He's the ultimate source. He's the ultimate source of, of, of living, right? Right. So not a God human being, alone. not an animal, not a spirit, not a spook, none of it. So right. God alone is the only being that has always existed, correct? Yes. So if we if the Bible demonstrates that Jesus has always existed, then that means that Jesus is God, correct? No, it means your Bible is flawed. That's fine. You could say that the Bible is flawed, but at least admit that, okay, if, if the Bible does teach that, then it is teaching that Jesus is God, even though you reject that notion. But to be fair, I don't, you I, it, right? I don't acknowledge it. I don't recognize and I don't acknowledge it at all. I believe that if you believe that the word, because the what, what convinces you that Jesus has always been here? What, what's the evidence for that? The Bible says it. Jesus, Jesus says it. What's, Okay, what does he say? What's the evidence? He, I'll say it again. He says in John chapter 17, verse 5, he says, mm -hmm. Father, glorify me together with yourself, with the glory that I had with you before the universe was created. That's so in the Jesus New Testament, right? That he existed with the Father before the universe existed. And that was the New Testament, right? Absolutely. What do you have in the Old Testament that supports your argument? Oh, beautiful. Go to so we have Micah chapter five verse two. Prophet okay, and Micah, what does it say? Chapter five mm -hmm. verse two. It says that the Messiah's uh, origin is from everlasting. It's from eternity. The Messiah's origin. Who's the who is the who is the origin? What is the source of the of the power that that, it's that from, he was created from? He comes from no. he comes from everlasting. That's the point. No, Jesus was a prophet. He was a man who was created by Allah, and he was from the word, from a decree, from the word be, and he was born from the Virgin Mary. This notion that you Christians have that Jesus has always been here and he's God Almighty is a paganistic term. This is something a part of this is, is very paganism. Is something that they have ascribed through the writings, and they have attributed it to to say that it comes from God, which which it hasn't. Um, we understand that that Christ Jesus was a human being. He had a soul and a flesh, just like me, just like you. We both have a flesh and a soul. Um, it's just the Christians have used. Listen, what I'm saying is this: This is my position, right? They're saying that Jesus is 100% man and 100% spirit. Okay. I'm 100% man and 100% spirit. No I got a spirit as well as a... Listen, they do. They say, no, no. Can they I say that Jesus said, is one. Please? Can I tell you what we okay, said? Okay, let, let, me, let me present my position and then you can, you can argue later. Coming from a, a, a let me present my position. I don't, care where, I don't care where it comes from. Listen. Okay, no problem. So from, from, what, I, from what I understand is that, as the Christians say when I talk to them, is that Jesus was 100% man and he was 100% God. And when you argue, when you have a debate with them, they switch back and forth to, the, oh, that was the flesh part. That was the spirit. And that's what they do on a rant. My position is this, is that all human beings that are human beings, just like Jesus, has a flesh and has a spirit and soul. That's my conclusion. Yeah. Okay. So you asked me, where does the Bible teach that Jesus always existed? And I gave you two parts. I gave you one in the New Testament where Jesus himself says that he existed always with the Father. And then I showed you, I gave you Micah chapter 5 verse 2 that says that he, he comes from everlasting, eternity. So right, and, and you do, and you do know, you do know that I'm okay. I'm, I'm gonna let you feel. I'm, no, no, I'm not cutting you off to cut you off to shut you down. I'm just saying something real quick, and you can go back to saying what you need to say. Um, you do know that I'm Muslim and I follow the Quran. I don't believe that the Bible is the is the Word of God, but I'm just saying, I'm I'm just telling you something. I'm just saying something to you. Yeah, no I don't problem. believe in the Bible to be. I don't believe the Bible is factual or true. Um, I believe that the Quran is true. So. When you show me something, it's not if it doesn't line up with what I understand and believe, then it's going to be completely rejected. But go ahead, I know. 
I know. I so yeah. I, I I know that you're a Muslim. I know what you believe, right? Mm. I know. I'm not I'm not forcing the Bible mm. on you. But this Because you're telling me you're talking to me, you're telling me you're talking to me, you're telling me, well if this bird if this bird I don't care. You're telling me if this Bible verse is here and it says it here, listen, I'm gonna say what I wanna say. If you don't like it, if you don't like it, you can get around. But you you said you'll let me talk. I don't care. If you don't like it, get out of here. So you want me so you want me to to go because you're running? I'm not saying I didn't say I want you to go. I said if you don't like it, you're welcome to continue staying. I'm just saying something to you. To you. Know, we gotta, we gotta, you gotta, you said you gotta be a man of your word, man. You said you let me talk. Say what? No, because what it is is that I'm saying something to you. What you're saying you, is you cut me off in the middle of me saying something. You, I was, listen, al I was already talking. You said I don't mean to cut you off to shut you down. I just want to say something real quick and then I'll let you finish. And then I, as soon as I started talking again, you cut me off again. No, you, you completed you your sentence. Finish. Listen, let, let me know when you're done because I'm tired of playing games with you. I will. Because you, you really you, you really just, yeah, you're just playing games and I'll really you, talking I'll silly to me. I'll let you know me. when I'm done. I'll let you know, I promise. So I know that I'm, I'm not forcing the Bible on you, but we are. you asked me to show you from the Bible where, why do I believe Jesus is God, that he's eternal and things of this nature. So I'm showing you from the Bible what the Bible teaches. I know you don't believe this. However, if you're honest and you're intellectually consistent, you have to acknowledge what the Bible teaches, even though you reject it, even though you don't believe it. Like, for example, when you read the Quran and you show me that the Quran says that Muhammad is the last messenger, I don't believe that. But what I can't do is say that the Quran doesn't say that. You know what I mean? If I'm honest, the Quran does say that. Yes, I just don't believe it. So the same way Jesus talked, the Bible teaches that Jesus is God, that he always existed. You can reject that, but you cannot say that the Bible doesn't teach that and be an honest person. You know, that, that, okay, that's what I'm saying. Are you, are you done? Are you done? I am done. Okay. So what I was saying was, my point was, is that we was having a dialogue and a, and a dialogue and a uh, discussion. And what you were doing was... You would show me that you would tell me a Bible verse and tell me that has to be true because of the Bible. You do know you was talking to me like this, talking about you do know this is true based upon the Bible. Right. And I'm simply trying to tell you, I don't believe in the Bible. So by you trying to tell me, oh, it, it's, it got to be true because it's there in the Bible means nothing to me because I follow the Quran. Now, what you can do is if I ask you a question, you can show me a verse in, in, in part of your defense. But the straw man mean to say, oh, look, it has to be true. Wouldn't you agree with that, that that has to be true because it's there in Acts this and John this and Matthew that? No, that's not how we doing this. Yeah. That's so all I'm you, saying to you. Yeah. Yeah. You, I, as, you, you didn't understand what I said. I don't think. Um, but no, I did understand exactly what you're saying. Yeah. So in uh, John 530. Uh, OK, so now is my question. It's my turn. You said you was done. It's my turn to ask you a question. No, you just finished. It's my it's turn to ask you a question. No, I haven't asked you a question. I just made a statement. Oh I made God, a bro. deliberately made a statement. My yeah, so, question is to you to, is. So then I started to listen. Speak no, 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 I you to speak, no, bro. no. You're not being fair. Listen, my question. Listen, you said you was done and I made the statement. And then you now I'm asking you a question. And now I'm responding. My question is John 5.30. We That's my question. About John 5.30 after I respond to what you said. Yeah, she, she missed the word. This is crazy. Oh, man. Oh, man. You, you got to be fair to, to the guests. Yeah, okay. What do you have to say? What do you have to say? What do you want to say? Okay. Go ahead, Logic. What? Thank you. Thank what? You, thank you. So, with both of us already agreeing that only God eternally exists, only God is the one who infinitely exists, doesn't have a beginning or end. With the Bible teaching that Jesus doesn't have a beginning or end, has always existed, can you at least agree that on that standard, that the Bible, even though you don't believe it, but the Bible is teaching that Jesus is indeed God by saying that he always existed? Can you agree that it does no. teach that? Does it? No, no. Why I don't? I don't agree with it. Okay, so what? Why not? Assalamu alaikum, Sheikh Dawood. How are you? Alaikum assalam, Yeah, Shaf I just this guy here. He's just you can't even really. He he he's really um he's really yeah. weird, dude. 
Yeah, I um, really debated him and smacked him around on the Quran, alhamdulillah. And there was a video, there's a video on uh, on it. Now it's time to be about the Bible. So is the there's Bible... There's a video on it, yet you guys didn't post my response. Oh, uh, well, why, right, man? We, we showed you when you were shocked when you seen the... the hilarious, that, hilarious. You man, looked man. with your big eyes. Well, it was funny. You, did, you didn't But anyways, didn't play forget my that response. for a second. Forget that. We'll move on well, from Allahi, that. you didn't play my we'll response move on from for, that. for a reason. Please, please, please. We'll I want to ask him another question. I'll ask him a question, and the captain, you guys can come in. Well, okay, well, so... I did, my, I did ask a question on this, Dawood. I'm waiting for you to answer. See how he's... This is what I'm saying. He keeps wanting to ask questions... And doesn't yeah, I, want to allow me to ask questions to challenge him, and he wants to keep talking. You have asked me questions. Listen, you asked me to allow you to finish. You allow. You said allow you to finish, and if I allowed you to finish, we would go to John five. John five thirty. Yeah, I've already allowed finished. you to finish. Now, why do you want to? No, listen. Point? No, listen. Start. We, we're starting at five thirty. That's what we're going to right now. That's another. I'm not going to play your game. Listen, this is my live, and I'm going Dude, there. If you don't, don't want to go Dude, there, Dude, 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 do you, you want to time this? He's, he's, Should we time it? Yeah. yeah you listen, know, he's completely uh, indi- uh, um. You know, uh, listen, it's John it's five thirty, right? It's all good. It's listen, all good. you a coward. You a I coward. I bet. You a freaking coward, dude. I bet. You scared of my questions, and you don't want to be challenged. I you want to sit here on my panel and just uh, just ask a bunch of questions I, I and do a whole bunch of talking and rambling, dude. This is all that I. No, you weak. You a weak. And that you're, no. you're trying to avoid my my me No, ain't nobody trying. Listen, I'm and listen. You scary, dude. Man, you weak, dude. You're being inconsistent. Listen, what? Listen, I'm going to John five thirty and John five thirty. Will Jesus, you give me a I'm fair going to now. respond to that too? Because I'll listen to you. Listen. Will you give me okay, a chance to respond? To I'm that? going to John for John five thirty. I'm, I'm talking about this. I'm not talking about nothing else. You talking about? No problem. I'm asking. I'm going to John five thirty and beyond. If you on this, will you give me a fair chance to respond? That's my question right now. Because I say, I'm, man, we, just listen cool. to. Just, man, okay, we're you, there. You, so, will you give me a fair chance to respond, though? Wait, wait, wait. Listen, I don't got time to play your game, dude. So is that I don't even like you. Let, let me know I don't I like you, dude. I don't like you, dude. I know. I Seriously, know. I don't like you. The, the darkness hates the no, light. No, I, I, I really just don't like you. I, I don't. Know. I know. I know. The I don't mind people light. challenging me and have a debate, but you come here on my live and then you try to, you don't want me to ask you any questions and you use the same excuse every single time. Every time I ask you a question, oh, dude, I didn't get to finish. Uh, let me make my point. Let me continue making my point. And then I, I allow you to make your point. And then I go to another question. And then you're like, wait a minute, wait a minute. And then you keep going back, doing the same thing over and over. You're in panic mode. No, I'm not. I'm just, I'm just, I don't want to deal with silliness, dude. Right, I so don't. Let's, let's, let's come to an agreement. No, get your okay. black ass off my panel. That's what you do. There we go. Look at that. How about that? Get this off. Goodbye. Right, ladies and gentlemen. Get off. Shut up. Shut up. I don't it's care. Um, That's what I got to say. The I don't care. I don't even care, dude. Get off. Bye. Oh, my God. Logic.